Well, hello there, everybody. Good morning. Welcome to this installment of 7 Minutes in the Morning. My name is Tom Rigsby, your host. Thank you so much for joining me this morning. I appreciate it. Um, how are you doing this morning? I hope you all are doing well. I... So it's Thursday morning, which means yesterday was Wednesday, which means last night was co-working night. And doggone if those kids didn't keep me up late again. <clears throat> I'm tired. I'm dragging a little bit this morning, but that's okay. We're going to make today a great day. I've already I've already been up for a couple hours, started my day with gratitude, and now I'm here with you. And uh, I would, well, one thing I would be grateful for, if you do what Joe just did, leave me a comment, say hi, let me know that you're here. This all this week, I've been talking about, um, well, well, not all this week, the, for the last two days, I, I've really gotten on this tear about progress, kind of in my, you know, social media commenting and put up a couple of things on Instagram about progress. I wanted, it, I, I wanted to take just a minute today and ask you, are you making progress? Are you making progress? That is our topic today. I'm going to peel that uh, onion, as Shrek would say. I'm going to peel that onion back just a little bit. Or that donkey. Oh, no, it was one of them. Anyway, uh, so be sure to like this video so that it gets out to those who might also benefit from it. If you have a question, you can drop that in the comments, too. All right, so here's the deal. Progress, progress is movement toward a goal. Yesterday, I posted a uh, picture on Instagram that says, I've never heard of anyone stumbling on something while they were sitting down. That's actually a pretty good quote. That's, <laughs> that's one of my favorites. You have to be moving, right? Even, even if you stumble, even if you fall, it's because you're moving. There's a reason why Progress is defined as movement toward a goal. Because if you're just sitting there, you you can't make progress. So you have to be doing something. And doing something doesn't, thinking about it doesn't count as doing something. Now, as I said that, I'm reminded of Einstein, who said he would think for 55 minutes before he, if he only had an hour to accomplish something, he'd think 55 minutes. That's Einstein. He's special. We need to be making progress. So movement, take small actions. You don't have to use whatever metaphor or old um, axiom you want. You don't have to eat the elephant in the whole, in one bite, you know, small steps, small steps. And the second half of that is toward a goal. Progress is movement toward a goal. If you don't know what it is that you're trying to create, it doesn't matter how much work you do, how many steps you take, how many bites of the elephant you eat. If you don't have a goal, you can't make progress. It's it's simple. Now, I want you to think about think about your inbox. That's a good one for most people. What's your goal for your inbox? Is it to get to inbox zero? Do you know that Gmail has, has made a nifty tool for helping us get to inbox zero? And you just go up there and click select all, delete. Done, inbox zero. But did you make any progress? I mean, th think about your to-do list. You don't have one laying around here. If you have a to-do list, what's your goal for the to-do list? All right? Is it to cross everything off and say, yay, I crossed everything off the to-do list? Did that move you toward an outcome? Maybe it did, or maybe for a lot of people, it's just a list of stuff to do. I want you. I, I've, this week, I've been talking about how I believe we're each uniquely gifted, talented, and placed to do work that matters. You can't do work that matters if you're not making progress toward that. Now, you know, here's reach out there a little bit further with this one. Success is a result of progress. 
work that matters will lead you to success. But you can be in a successful state. Success is a state, right? You can be in it or out of it, move into it, move out of it. Many times a day sometimes. My favorite metaphor is baseball. 162 games in a major league season, regular season. The team that wins the World Series has yet to win every baseball game, but they are still successful, right? You don't have to win every encounter. You don't have to, you don't have to be successful in every step. And look, I, boy, I read this on, uh, somebody was writing about this on Facebook. A lot of people, when they achieve an unsuccessful outcome, think, okay, I got to make a U-turn, go all the way back to the beginning and start over. No, you don't. If you're going off this way, going off this way, and then all of a sudden find out you were supposed to be going that way, all you have to do is turn left and then start going that way. You have to go all the way back to the beginning. You don't have to give up all of the forward progress you've already made. You learned through that. So take advantage of that. All right. So question for you today. Are you making progress? Are you making movement toward a goal? If I were to sit down with you across the table at the coffee shop and say, what's your goal? What are you working toward? Could you answer that in one sentence? Some people can. Some people can't. My question for you is, can you? If you can't, then that's something we need to work on. If you'd like for me to help you work on it, shoot me a message. I'll be happy to do that. Uh, all right. I'm going to call it a show right there. Wrap it up for this Thursday. I hope that's helped. Giving you something to think about today as you go through your day um, and work toward progress. All right. I, I like to put these in the form of a question so you'll think about them throughout the day. If, if you have questions, <coughs> comments, or topics you'd like for me to hit, especially tomorrow, since tomorrow's Free Coaching Friday, put those down in the comments. Let me see those. I'll get those included. Um, yep, I think that's it. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. You guys have a terrific Thursday. Thankful Thursday. Thorough Thursday. I don't know. You guys have a great Thursday. I'll talk to you again tomorrow. Oh, hey, bonus time here today. Surprise. <laughs> um, it occurred to me as I was turning off the lower third there that it might be a good idea to remind you about Fast Five. If you are challenged with making progress, this is a good way to get started. Just saying. Six, I'm pretty sure it's six sessions. Uh, video, workbook, whole nine yards. You can go in there, worksheets. You can go in there and... It, it'll help you, especially if you can't articulate the outcome you're trying to create. It'll help you get that down into one sentence. All right. Totally free. No cost. Go in there, put your name and email in. It's all yours. And feel free to share that if that's something that'll help somebody else. I've got it up on the screen. If you're watching the video stream, if you're listening in your favorite podcast catcher, it's tomrigsby.com slash fast five. That's the word fast and the number five, fast five all scrunched up there together, that'll get you to the right place. All right, that's it for bonus material today. You guys have a great day. Talk to you tomorrow.